So during this lesson, we learned about memes, uh, primarily through Richard Dawkins. Um, and one of the things that initially captured my attention was the fact that memes are not more recent uh, in terms of the past few years coming about, but um, rather have been an idea for the past few decades, before the internet really. Um, and that the concept of an internet meme is, according to Richard Dawkins, somewhat of a hijacking of his idea of a meme. And I thought it was really cool that he used the analogy of a gene to compare that with memes in that um, genes spread throughout the gene pool and are passed from brain to brain even after bodily death. Um, and in the same way memes are passed throughout human culture um, even after death and you know they are sort of spread out in a way that is natural such as you know us passing on our genetic makeup um, and, and then sort of going back to the idea of you know Dawkins saying that um, the internet meme is a hijacking of his original idea um, and he talks about the notion of something being designed and something appearing to be designed and one of the examples he uses there is a plane versus a bird. Um, although a bird functions efficiently, effectively, and it seems as though it's been designed, it has actually come about through natural selection, whereas a plane, um, which functions in a lot of the same ways, um, came about because of design. Um, in such a same way that his concept of a meme being something that occurs naturally in human culture um, is not necessarily designed where the idea of an internet meme is something uh, that has been created with some intention um, and not necessarily uh, coming out of uh, natural human interaction. Um, so yeah, I think there was one more thing that I wanted to mention that I thought was interesting. I have a note here somewhere. Um, yeah, and uh, I think I mentioned it somewhat. Um, but he compares how a meme can spread from blog to blog much in the same way that uh, genes can pass from brain to brain. Um, but yeah, I look forward to talking about this tomorrow in class and seeing what everybody else thinks about that. Uh, the comparison of genes and memes.